Pointing Nerdigans, this is the one and only Packer Curl 89 of Nerdigans Inc. And today's manga Nerdigan live reaction video is going to be for P, 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 chapter 56. So before I get into this recap and live reaction, let me just remind you to hit that like, share, and subscribe buttons. And because, of course, this channel, let alone this video, are not sponsored and not being sponsored by Shueisha and being sponsored by Manga Plus and being sponsored by Fizz. And considering how much we promote um, Manga, Plus on, Manga Plus on this channel, it's kind of surprising, right? But if you love what we're doing and want to help keep this operation alive and kicking so we can keep bringing you more anime and manga content, whether it be news, analysis, or live reactions like this one, feel free to head over Cash App and PayPal. Links are in the description box below. So, ooh, fam, so we saw Lucky play last chapter. And the poor, um, talented Lucky, the genius Lucky, he was talking about how he has been suppressed and he does not want to come out to play. And it's very interesting how alike him and Fanta are. And Fanta is just like, nah, nah, I'm not coming out. Um, you can try and get me all you want, but I'm not coming out. And you have, um, Sora Chica trying to get uh, Lucky to come out too. And he's like, no, not yet. I'm not ready yet. But I think it's Fanta's turn up. So let's get to this chapter, see what's in store for us this week. And this chapter is titled, Nonetheless. Here we go. This isn't fair timing. That's, yeah, because Mama's not doing well. Nah, that's, that's true. I guess I'm just lucky. Anyway, I apologize for you inviting you to this event. I'm sorry. When I think about it, you were cast aside by Dad. I have no right to say anything about the scandal. Even if the uh, Otokami brand's value diminishes, I can raise it ag um, again without involving you. I want you and Mom to be happy. If you see her, things could change. What, Rejiro? Okay, I'm not going. I don't need things to change. I can't trust Mom, so I've decided never to believe her. It's serious, right? Yeah, you should take him there. Let's go, Lucky. Let's not force Fanta to come with us. Rejiro called a car for us. But I want the seven of us to play piano for Mom again. Sorry for your last ten years, but that's impossible. I feel like I'm doing something really wrong. See, Fanta knows. Maybe it's wrong, nonetheless. That's right, nonetheless. Those wonderful days ended when I wasn't chosen. I couldn't believe in anything. We can't live together. I'm sorry. Goodbye. I love you. Nonetheless, I thought about it. She loved me, but she didn't choose me. She says she treasured me, but I don't believe her. No one has just one feeling. I'm sure she actually really loved me. So I will continue to believe your words from back then. But I won't believe in you. You chose not to choose me um, out of all the feelings you had, Mom. And I'll never believe you again. I can never trust you. I hate you. Okay, then. I'm looking really cool today, too. Um, I took pride in the feeling of being loved. Not being chosen was humiliating, so I chose to love myself. I worked really hard. The audience's applause told me I was valuable. I love that feeling. I did my best to give the audience what they wanted, as gratitude for their applause, because I wish the audience would never stop clapping. AKA it's fantasy world. It's the same in my personal life. The me I can love, uh, the me that the audience wants, I worked hard to cultivate the cool me. But it's still a fantasy. I know Fanta says he loves himself, but he's seeking validation. He still, if he truly loved himself, he wouldn't be seeking validation from the audience. It's cooler if I'm popular with the ladies. It's cooler if I'm good at my job. The more the Otogami brand is valued, the cooler I am. And the more you see the validation you get. But you still are seeking validation. Because you were abandoned. Since I'm famous and I have money, weird people are attracted to me, but... Ooh, God, weird people are attracted to you. Ooh, something went down. I knew nobody really cared about me, so it didn't matter. Above all, I'm always self-aware, so I'm fine. Oh, I want to know more about that. But being on stage is the best. If I look cool, then right now, I have value. People will care. That's why I can never make a mistake. I can never let my value go down because of a mistake. I never got nervous in the past. I was never loved, and I expected to be treasured as a genius. 
you've ever felt abandoned like this and you've always sucked um, sought validation, you probably relate to this right now. Or fuck, not even just felt abandoned, but if you um, and have abandonment issues or trust issues, but if you've always felt like you needed to seek validation, you probably feel this way. I was effortlessly cool. I had value. It's all right. Even now, I'm no. My genius is uh, valued and well regarded. As long as I have that, I'm all right. My circumstances aren't at all tragic. I live in a mansion. I have everything I want. A handsome face, a nice body, and this genius. My genius won't desert me. There are other ge geniuses besides me. There will be someone I can't win against, but I should practice. It's all right. My genius is cool. My genius is mine alone. It's no longer mine alone. No, because he, he saw... So, so Dame came into his world, so he knows he's no longer a genius anymore. He's no longer alone in his fantasy realm. Nope. Someone came into his world. No, it's okay. I'm the one who challenged him. I could think about it again later. Being a genius wasn't the one and only thing. Um, so then what the audience wants is, Mao, um, we're currently preparing for the next performer. Hmm? The audience will switch after this event, right? Yeah, that's right, then. Hey, why was that redhead able to show us uh, Fanta's theme park, right? But all the performers today were about the theme park. It really felt like the train ride home after the park closes. I totally get that. I feel like just, um, I feel like just going home. You want to go home? Oh. No, I'm, I'm sorry. <laughs> it's fine. I'll let you go home feeling really happy. Hmm. Poor Fanta. See, Fanta is dealing with his own thing. He's struggling internally. Ever since Sadame got into his realm and was able to be on the same level as him and was able to say, look, it's time to go. You can't be in this fantasy anymore. It's time to come back to reality. Fanta has been struggling eternally. And he's facing the reality of his abandonment issues. And then Lucky with the train home really brought that to light. And then now mom is not doing so well. And he's having to face it head on. And he's realizing he has not really been doing what he wants for him. He's only been doing what the audience wants, and now he has to make a decision. And he's choosing to do what the audience expects of him to. Like, and it really just sucks. It, it, you got to feel bad. He has to seek that. He's just seeking validation. That's all he's doing. It's so sad. It's so heartbreaking. I'm really curious if you guys are getting that sense and if you guys have ever felt that, if you guys have felt like Fanta where you are just seeking validation and um, have gotten that reality check um, like uh, Fanta has. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below and remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe to Nerdigan Zinc. If you love what we're doing, you want to help keep this operation alive and kicking so I can keep bringing you more... Um, uh, P -p 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 content, a few ways you can do that, donate to our cash app, PayPal, Patreon, purchase something off our Amazon wish list, all that's in the description box below. Also, make sure you follow us on Twitter, Twitch, Discord, friend us on PlayStation Network, that's in the description box below as well. Till next time, Nerdigans, I will be seeing you later. Bye!